Best Clipchev video editing tips and tricks for beginners. Hey guys, welcome back to the YouTube channel. Today we'll be taking a look at some of the best tips and tricks that I have found on Clipchamp that can help you upgrade your video editing. So let's get into it. Now we're not going to be focusing on the basic, you know, video editing stuff. We're going to be focusing on some of the tips and tricks that you might not have initially thought of, but are amazing in Clipchamp because Clipchamp is such a powerful software and people really do underestimate it. People don't realize that you can do quite a lot with Clipchamp and it enables you to have so many amazing features as well so starting off if you go into the music and sfx and you take a look at whatever music you have added so we can click on the music over here and we're just importing some music over here somewhere in the mountains and you can you know trim the music in accordance to however much you need i'm just going to trim it like so so if you have music with text so what you can do is go on ahead and uh, take the text and have it automatically be turned into uh you know text to speech so if you're writing captions you don't have to write them all together you can go on ahead and just click on this and then click on the captions over here and click on turn on auto captions and then select the language and this will automatically add captions from your music so whatever they say in the music this is obviously a lyric free music but if you have you know lyrics in your music or background so if you want to do voiceovers and you want the text to be written as it is displayed on the screen you can do auto captions on their platform it's simple and easy and you don't have to you know spend 50 hours you know just writing captions on all of your videos you can do auto captions plus you also have text to speech so if you add a audio file and if you don't have an audio file and you just want to enter some text you can go into your text over here and you can enter whatever text it might be so let's say we're just going to add this so let's say we enter this text over here and you want it to you know be provided in terms of audio so if i take my text over here and i just edit it like so I can move it over here and I can just click on the captions over here and you can turn on captions as well and then go on ahead and go into the filters and take a look at the text options to create this as a audio. Now, if you go on ahead and click on record and create over here, you can also choose to record and you can click on text to speech over here and then you can enter a text over here. You can choose multiple different voice chats as well. You can choose assistant chat, customer service. You can also choose multiple different voices so you have a you know a bunch of different voices over here you also have the pitch so what kind of pitch should it be how fast should the person be speaking all of these are features so let's say we're just going to add you know a couple of text and i'll show you guys what it sounds like so let's say we want the voice of jenny and we want it to be regular speech regular voice styles i think the wildlife preservers bringing you a glimpse into our work so you can see it, it does sound a little robotic but it's still amazing and you can easily you know enter you know voiceovers to your videos if you don't have someone to do that for you so it's simple easy and effective to add now what other features are hidden and you don't realize that they're just there so this feature is you know hidden in plain sight you don't often think that you're going to find text to speech in your record and create but you do now other than that you also have things such as import so you can go into your media and you can click on import media and you can directly import from your phone as well you can use icloud to uh, import media as well and then you also have things such as automatic captions as i showed you guys and you can also record your screen and webcam at the same time so this is amazing if you're a product if you review websites if you do reaction videos this can be an amazing feature Plus, you also can go into their template section and within their template section, they have amazing preset templates for YouTube subscribe buttons, Instagram intros, uh, YouTube intros, um, you know, all that basic stuff. You can go into YouTube and you can see they have, you know, gaming intros, YouTube intros. They have, you know, a bunch of different things like this. So uh, you can choose any one of these and enter those in your videos without having to pay, you know, a bunch of money. You know, you have to pay like 20 to $30 even on freelancers on Fiverr, at least that's like the bare minimum. You have to pay for subscribe buttons and edits like those. Now, other than that, you also have picture and picture features. So let's say I have a video running. 
So we have our music, we have our video. Let's say I want to play a mini video over here as well. So I can easily do that by going into my media. Let's say I want, I'll just use some stock video from over here. So I can just use this. So I can enter that into the timeline. And what I all I have to do is just move it into the right place. And then currently it's being imported, but I'm going to reduce the size of the frame. And then I can just expand this over here, cut this over here, go into my preview bar. And now you can see I have simple picture and picture. So I don't even have to do anything complex and I can, you know, place this accurately. But this is just an example for you guys to see. Now I'm going to select this. I can click on over here and place it at the bottom, at the top, whatever it might be. You can easily do picture and picture with Clipchamp as well. So they have a bunch of powerful features packed in a online video editor for a very low price. Now you also have things such as transitions and sfx so if you go into your transition section over here you actually have a bunch of different transitions you can choose from other than basic ones like powerpoint transitions you have a bunch of different stuff you can choose from and if you go into your sfx over here you can go on ahead and enter some music that is free to use with their platform as well now other than that you can also go on ahead and go into their graphic section and find different gifs that you can use and also convert or you can click on export over here here and export your videos as GIF. So to create a GIF out of anything, just upload it over here, click on export, click on GIF, and then you will be able to export it as a GIF. So all these powerful tools are available for a very low price of around $19. So uh, if your essentials version is costing, wait, let me convert that for you guys. Yeah, so around $11.99, that is what their essentials version costs. And their basic features that I just used, so some of the basic features are available for free. However, you do have a watermark with that, but you get all of these amazing, amazing features for free and for a very low price. You can also get unlimited watermark free exports as well as premium audio images and videos. So you get a bunch of stock video as well as filters and effects, brand kits and content backup as well. So that was it for today. I hope you guys found this video helpful and you are now able to follow along with these methods and techniques that I showed in this video. And if you found them helpful, make sure to share them with someone you might think that may need these. Share them with your friends, with your family, with your cousins, and share them with any business partners that you might have. And it might help you guys a lot to know all of these techniques and to follow along. And if you enjoyed this video, I would recommend that you please leave a like and if you have any questions regarding this video, regarding any other video, or regarding any social platform, then you can definitely ask me in the comments down below and I will try to answer as soon as possible because that is the point of our YouTube channel. I want to show you guys on how to glide through these platforms and how to easily navigate and fulfill the purposes that you want to do with these social platforms and if you have any details that you might want to know any suggestions any improvements that you think that i could add on to these videos then please do leave them in the comment box down below and i will make future videos according to those and if you have any specific topics that you look forward to also leave those in the comment box down below and I will try to make videos on those as well and make sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel and check out other videos and if you feel like some other video might be helpful to someone else make sure to share our videos with your friends and family as well and if you find that there is something missing I will try to figure out a way to an uh, integrate more accurate content according to your needs onto the channel so make sure to tell me if you find anything missing so that was it for today make sure to leave a like and subscribe to the youtube channel and i will catch you guys in the next video